Aloha folks, welcome to another video. My name is Mark, Mr. Dividend Investor. Today I got something good for you guys. You definitely want to check out this company. Uh, put it on your watch list. As always, please remember this is not a financial advice. If you are new to the channel, just wanted to say welcome, aloha. If you are new to investing and you want to learn about what companies are great on to invest on, whether it's dividends, growth stocks, or even penny stocks, you definitely want to subscribe and also hit that notification bell. You don't want to miss out on some of the great companies that uh, I look at, some of the great companies that uh, that you can possibly invest on. Uh, I want you to join my little community of Ahana of investors as we together invest in great companies to make money in the stock market. So without any more delays, let's take a look at this company. All right, let's take first on the list. On this one, on this video, we're going to look at CT Trends Incorporated. The ticker symbol is CTRN. It is a value price retailer of urban fashion, apparel, and accessories for the entire family. So they operate in South, Southeast, and Middle Atlantic region. So as you can see, based on their website, you can see it is... Uh, and a uh, you know a clothing apparel so you got company uh, so you got for the juniors clothing you got for the big man you got plus clothing for the ladies you got some home products uh, as you can see from here now if we look at some of the information simply the safe dividends you got return on equity which is uh, the last nine months is nine percent return on investment capital which is six percent operation management margin is 3% free cash flow margin is 8% uh, so those are just some of the stats to look at now if we look at CNN business as you can see based on their analysis they have a high estimate of 93 at the time of this video it's $82 with a low estimate of 883 so it represents a 6% increase. Now, if we look at the recommendation, it is a recommend buy based on one. Uh, if we look at the chart, as you can see, based on the chart year to date, you can see the upward trend, which is great. It is a small market cap of 834 with the weak high of 84. So it's definitely going to hit that at some point. Now, if we look down further to the earnings, it beats a quarter one. Now, looking at the revenue, you can see it has been doing great revenue as well as the earnings. Revenue in 2020 was 781 million. 2019 was 769 million. So, um, those are great numbers in my opinion. Now, if we look at the Yahoo Finance, you can see the top institutional holdings. There's 129. Um, uh, the BlackRock bought 749. You got Alliance Bernstein at 685. Then you got Dimensional Funds at 880. So uh, Vanguard is right there, bought about 469. Now, if we look at Weeble, you can see also 166 institutions hold this with 28 increase, 39 of them new, 40 of them decrease. Now, if we look down to their price target, so there were pretty uh, stuff which 40 so they pretty much uh, shattered that now if we look at the analysis there was only one with rated as a buy now if we go look further to bar chart uh, looking at the key statistics you can see their growth uh, one year return is 265 three year return is 233 five year return is 301 um, percent they did look like they did do some dividends in there but you know um, I think it stopped I'm not sure um, it looked like I checked to see it in the dividend uh, simply say dividend and it didn't have so I think they were paying dividend uh, for like one year and so and then they, they stopped so um, now looking at the trend which is why I'm bringing up to you so this is the nine month chart if you look at the chart it is a beautiful chart upward trend if you look at the volume the volume has been great now if we look at six months chart as well this is the six months look at that upward trend beautiful upper trend it has been increasing in volume as you can see the MACD has also crossed 
it is in the overbought so that's something for you to think about now if we go back to even as far as the three month chart look at that just a beautiful upward trend um, it is pretty much higher in this one so uh, something to consider um, but I'm definitely taking a look at this company I think in my opinion if, if I'm going to invest on it it is probably something as a swing trade um, just to make the profits get the profits go out use that profits for more dividend companies so that's probably going to be my play on this company uh, so uh, you definitely want to go check uh, some of my videos as well um, there's a lot in there that I think would be uh, beneficial in my opinion for you guys as always Thank you so much for watching. Hope you like this video. If you do, definitely give it a thumbs up. If you're not yet a subscriber, man, you definitely want to subscribe. Uh, hit that notification bell. You don't want to miss out on some of the uh, videos that I put out. Uh, as always, guys, please remember to do your research, do your own due diligence, have a plan uh, on what you and how you want to get in, how you want to get out, what stocks you want to buy, how many stocks you want to buy. Okay, those are important keys uh, when you are investing, in my opinion. Okay, thank you so much for watching again. It really does mean a lot to me. Uh, hope you like this video. As always, please remember, stay cool, keep investing, and I'll catch you guys on the next video, all right? Take care and aloha.